Hey guys, what's up? It's Shinobi Ranger here and welcome back to another episode of our Age of Empires 4 campaign playthrough playing the second campaign this 100 years war and we shall be proceeding to the fourth scenario of this campaign but before we proceed ahead with this campaign video if you missed out any of the previous scenarios of this campaign playthrough you would be finding the playlist notification popping up in the right top corner of the screen Okay, now before we proceed ahead let me just clarify a few things right, So you would have noticed that we didn't gain any XP for the previous episode due to some Profession. I just played it again in my own free time and I got a bit of XP. Okay. I followed the same tactics I used in the recording and honestly it was far more peaceful. Life was better. And also one more thing I forgot to inform you guys. As soon as you get 1000 gold in the village of I forgot the name. The, the the second village, not Kosherel, not Juvi, the second one, the second one which has the gold mine and stone mine. Make sure you pay those rupees, that 1000 gold as soon as possible. So that what you can do is, you can gather your army and attack Kosherel and have a large enough force to fend off the enemy forces, Shals of Navar's forces. They will be primarily, there will only be knights advancing at you. Right? So just block off all entry points or most entry points with walls and add towers. If you don't add towers, the knights will skirt around the map, they will look for an opening to attack. If you have towers, they will attack the towers and you can deploy arbalatriers on the walls and shoot them down. Okay? Properly defending... Uh, you would need maybe 10, at least 20 hour 25 hour blast years. 12 near the bridge and 12 in the north. Okay. So those units should be far than, far, I mean, I mean to say, should be more than sufficient to deal with what is happening. Okay. But let's proceed on to the next scenario today. That was all for the third scenario. Okay. Okay. The third scenario, fast forward six years down the line in disorder, the battle of Pontvalain. Discord and rivalry had divided the English army. Now was France's moment to strike. Let us start. With rebels and raiders eliminated at Cocherel, King Charles V faced one last threat to France, the relentless English invaders. Word arrived that the English army was weak and scattered, divided by infighting. The king quickly directed his army to chase down the old enemy of France. At Pont Valin. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. okay, 1370, the Battle of Pont Valin. Infighting had split the English army into rival factions. As these scattered groups raided their way towards Pont Valin, the French army prepared, prepared to stamp them out. Okay, is this a defense or an offense? Ooh, bombards. I see cannons, I see hand cannons, spearmen, mounted knights, siege towers. Mmm, looks tasty. Pong Walan, okay. Uh, okay, now I should remember that so that I don't screw up the pronunciation. And let us load on. Okay, and as I was uh, still saying in the previous one, at uh, the, the third mission, the mission where chaos is the name of where France and chaos. So don't just leave the walls just like that because they will just be a barrier. The knights will just move around the map searching for an entry point and it is going to be horrible. Okay, so until you are in a position to build up towers and basically like, trap them like uh, they are attracted like flies to flies to what or later okay uh, if not, not no that's not appropriate like ants to sugar they are attracted like ants to sugar or bees to flowers okay those towers will make them come into attack and into range of their um, arbalesters arbalatriers you can see the damage arbalatriers do to armored units okay all right, let's proceed with this mission. Hold on. 
the French town of pont lay directly in the path of marauding English soldiers on the hunt for loot. The town's only hope of survival lay with the French forces camped nearby. The French quickly prepared to ambush the disorganized English raiders and defend pont from ruin. Okay. Oh. La bourse paiera par pour venir. Colonnes sont ici. So the town center must survive, eh? Where is the market? Let's go. All right. Parate, uh... allons-y. The main English army thundered into the valley. They paused to rest beyond the town before launching their raid. Okay, that ain't pretty. Oh, the English are attacking in 15 minutes. Is it okay? Okay, okay, okay. All right. Step up, step up, step up, step it up. We gotta step it up. I don't have stone. What do I have? What do I have? Archery range, blacksmith. Oh, stables. Is that a stable? Is that a stable? Shit. Okay, okay, okay. Quickly, get to work. We need to get to work ASAP. Uh, these guys may raid us. I mean, these English may raid us soon. Guys is not an appropriate term for looting, marauding troopers. Chamber of Commerce. This is two active traders. It's an economic landmark. Okay. I need a scout on it. There's a scout is go get me. Oh, are we gonna depend on no 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 hold on hold on hold on Oh my god A small bandit camp lurked in the valley. If uh -oh. the French could defeat these UTA, they could claim the supplies they had gathered. Okay. Fine. Thank god I saw that. Thank you, Scout. And one more thing is, please use your Scouts. They have a long line of sight. Alright? Far better than anybody. Okay? Those Scouts are really precious. You can give line of sight to your siege engines to fire and boy, they are gonna get messed up. Seriously messed up. I ain't even joking. Oh my god. Oh. Uh, so, Quick, 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 quick! We don't have much time! Uh, archery range, come on. Quickly! I can upgrade to the third age, not yet. Alright, uh, chop lumber. Okay. Quickly. Where is that? Where is that? Quick, 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 quick. I need troops. Eight spearmen. Uh, okay, chop lumber. Go, 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 go. Oh, what? The first group of English raiders began their attacks on the outlying farms. After destroying the farms, they would attack the town of pont -Vala. What? Uh oh! Oh no! What did I do? Oh, oh shit! I see that a mile away. No, damn you! Oh, there you go. This is not pleasant. Oh god, quickly! Three raiding parties, oh my god, where are my troops? Run, 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 run
double up, double up, double up, double up, double up, quick, 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 quick. Ah, uh, it is the cube building. Run. Okay. Oh yeah, get skewered. Quick, quick, quick. Uh, blacksmith, I don't have gold. Damn it. Quick, 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 quick. More spearmen. <laughs> Cavalry. <coughs> Me. Uh, are we winning? Are we losing? Are we winning? Are we losing? Oh yeah, we are winning all right. So we are taking losses in terms of spearmen. Those shouts are scaring me right now. Okay, uh, this force should be sufficient. Nothing else, no, 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 nothing else. My god, the amount of gold we need. Alright, let's move quick, quick, quick. Hitler, there's another Hitler. Come over here, quick, quick, quick. Yeah, we'll, we'll fight them off, don't worry. Yep, we are doing it. A lot of damage to them. And we should be attacking in 10 minutes. My god. My god. There is barely any gold. Oh, please, quickly, hurry up. I am scared now. Done. Let's just scout, 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 scout. Scout return. Quick, 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 quick. Ten minutes. No, 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 wait, wait, wait. Let the scout go ahead. Let the scout go ahead. I'm just exploring a bit. Oh, oh, oh. Not present. Wait. Now, 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 charge. What else? Anything else? Alright, they're screwed. They're screwed. Leave them be. Oh man, we're gonna cut down. Okay. Uh, oh, I hate this. Come on, come on, I need those upgrades. Those upgrades can save my life. Alright. There's a gold mine there. More scattered English raiders arrived and made their way towards Povala. Uh huh. So that is their raiding spot. Alright. Advance. Okay, I saw that a mile away. Alright. Oh, this request Castlage. This request Castlage. Damn, damn, damn. Go, charge. Cursor uh, obedience. Multiple things to handle. L -l 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 -l. Oh, where are these two cars? Oh my god. They are screwed now. They are. There are knights. And God help me. Yeah, there you go. Butcher them, butcher them, butcher them. We may lose, we will lose, we will lose for sure. What am I kidding? Who am I kidding? There we go. Yeah, we lose, we lose. I know that. I really do not have the funds right now. What do I do? What do I freaking do? Oh, all of them are dead. How much time do you need to kill off? No, 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 no. Claim that gold. Quick, quick. Yeah, burn it, burn it, burn it. Quick, quick, ASAP. Yeah, they're gonna burn every damn thing to the ground. Alright. 
Not funny, you know. I I am really praying they do not attack with how one. Okay, now I am getting freakishly scared. Can I just have some troops, please? It's pyramid. Oh, dude, we had one spearman. Spare. No, 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 please don't attack others. I'm dead. Oh, I'm scared now. I'm really scared now. You burn the farms, I don't give a damn. Don't touch the town. Oh, God. As I feared. Shit, 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 shit. Oh my god. There are those spearmen. You need to like ASAP get over there. Oh shit. Oh shit, shit, shit. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Yeah, we are done. Okay, I need to restart. Restart. No. Have to restart. Have to restart. The fifth time. I do not know what to do, God, at this rate. I really do not know what to do, God. Oh my God, this is so difficult. The French town of Pontvala lay directly in the path of marauding English soldiers on the hunt for loot. The town's only hope of survival lay with the French forces camped nearby. The French quickly prepared to ambush the disorganized English raiders and defend Pontvala from ruin. Oh. Oh. Okay. Here we go, attempt number 5. I will sell gold. We are upgrade quick. Go there. Blah 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 blah. I'm doing this as fast as I can. Beyond this, even I don't know what I can do. Godi Godi God, Godi God. Yeah, the English army saw that. The army thundered into the valley. They paused to rest beyond the town before launching their raid. Uh, uh, sixteen minutes. Now sixteen minutes. Less than sixteen minutes to prepare. Okay, we done the barracks. Wait. Oh. I don't like the sound of that drumming. It is starting to get on my nerves right now. Why can't you move a bit quickly? Getting such less gold. Go 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 just go 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 for it just go for it If I fail this time I'm gonna be super pissed off Five attempts is not a joke these idiots better be worth it this time. Four, six, 
eight. How much number do we need? One fifty. Oh, so close! Come on, come on, come on, come on! Come on, come on, come on! Come on. Ten on lumber. Twelve on lumber. Fourteen on food. No, twelve on food. Well, one, two, six on gold this time. I need to try that method at least. Glee at the point where I'm gonna go mad. Well, on lumber. Go, go, go. Two on food. Two more on food. Sorry. Okay. The time those raiders come in. Here, I'm ready. Ready. The thing. Why am I prioritizing going to the next stage? It is important. That is why. What? Yeah, the food. Oh, there we go. There comes the first group of English raiders began their attacks on the outlying farms. After Much destroying food. the farms, they would attack the town of Pontvala. Yeah, yeah, you'll attack the town. What else? What else can you do? It's that number, it's that number. A small bandit camp lurked in the valley. Yeah, they're if lurking the in the valley. If the French could defeat these routiers, they could claim the supplies they had gathered. Wait, better idea. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm going to defend here. Let them take their time to attack us. Yeah, let let us do that. Spearmen go forward. Archers, speed yeah. All done here, right? Okay, more spearmen, more horsemen. Play, play. How many more do I need? One, two, three, four. Oh my God, food. Oh. Ho, ho. Get over there. Quick, 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 quick. So while those raiders get their business done, six horsemen. Please all do it. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We need to play for time here. I get it now. I get it now. I was far too eager to get out there and fight. Far too eager. Sell, 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 sell it all. Sell it all quick. Okay, here we go. Okay, stand there while I deal with them. The more time they take, the better for me. Now then, six forty gold. Let's come in. Two people harvesting the food. Hey, come on, come on. You can do this. Okay, the scout. Stand there. Right, go, 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 go! Kill them on, quick, quick, quick! Kill those archers while our spearmen deal with them. Okay, while they are at it, let us get out more spearmen. Six, eight. Make it ten. Done. All done. Loot, loot that, loot that quick. Oh yeah, they fell right in the trap. Good. There we go. Don't bother wasting your time. You just go stand, take a positions there, quick. That's it. Shoot them down. Shoot them down. Focus fire. Focus fire. Need to focus fire. See. Right, you go back there. Two, four, six people. Quick, go. Run, 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 run. Another soldier. How many? How many have I recruited? Good. We defended. Shh. 
Go on, defend here. Ooh, six villagers. The food will flow in. No need to worry about the food. Get over there. Run, 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 run. Where is that? This guy, go and torch that there. More scattered English raiders arrived and made their way towards Pontvala. We saw it a mile away. We will defend at the town. Let them take the time to burn the settlements. Okay. Oh, this is har harrowing. It's really harrowing. Far too harrowing. Little dude is there. Oh, how, how many men do we have here? 18 spearmen, won't cut it out. How many do we have? 8 spearmen, here we go. Oh. So these spearmen and archers can help us. But the force is ready. Is the production going? You build a mill that quick. You build a mill. You six, get over there quick. And build a mining camp fast. We need to rush. We need to hustle. Hustle right now. Yeah, man. Good, 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 good. Run, run, run. Get over there. Need to run. Ooh. Go there. Go there. Sell it for gold. Buy with food. Okay, now you start building. Building, build, 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 build. You four, leave that. Get over here. Okay, more spear. Get more spear. Good, 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 good. All right. Now, now we will face them off. Good. Very good. Yeah, what are you idiots doing? Standing still. On to die. Come and die. Yeah, they can fight them off, fight them off. Charge them! Charge them! More spearmen, have them ready, have them ready. Next wave is gonna be knights. Alright, if you get that raid, I'm gonna come from this side. Run! Rush, 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 hustle, hustle, people, hustle. We need food production, we need that upgrade. Come on, no lumber. How many spearmen do we have? Well, good. Go, 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 go. Quick, build arsenal, fast. Rush it, rush it, rush it. More Remember. scattered English raiders arrived and made their way towards Pontvala. Here we go. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, they're going to be coming from that side. Here we go. You know those arbor listers. You need those arbor triers. You need that. You need gold. Good. 
besoin d'un petit trait sans nul arrête. Monastery. Not done any research here. I am at a point where I am just throwing in troops. And a huge force of knights. Our blasters, you need to move. That was a mistake I did. Quickly research that. Or I can pull back to the town. Pull back to the town, that's it. Go, go! Anything to give us more time. These English should come in. These English are going to come in. No, 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 stay there, stay there. God. Upgrade that. Let's upgrade that to veteran as well. Melee armor. Oh my god, all knights. Blisters, rush over there, quick, quick, quick. Great buttons. Back up grade. Steel armor, good. Oh, the tension is really killing me right now. Okay, we need more arbalesters. I'm worried. Go, rush to the. There we go. Not this time. Arbalesters are ready, and we have allied troops to support. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. That is what I'm talking about. Man, my fingers are numb already. Numb with fear. And that's men at arms. Oh my god, is this army for real or what? Alright, less than a minute. Less than a minute. Oh god. Oi, Mestier de Moué, don't steal. And this one. And this one. Don't steal. Oh, well, I'm not going to be fun. A chest, Mestier. Sivay. Don't steal. Wow. Oh, that huge war for me. Those many survived. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Courrior, rest for this party. More than a minute. More than a minute. Wait, early men at arms, is it? Hold on. Three. Oh, okay. If that is the case, hold on. Need gold, right? A little bit more gold. All right, all right. Okay, okay. Still it, boys. Still it. You buffoons won't know what's gonna hit you. Yes, that's it. No, that for me. Okay, much gold, more, much more gold. Three hundred gold. Come on. Ah. Eleven seconds. This is freakish. Run. They are heading at us. They are heading towards us. The English army chose their moment and began to close in on Pont Valar. All right. All right. This is it. This is all she wrote, boys. But man, you know what? Wait, 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 wait. wait. I'm going to save. It. Can I save it here? Yes, I will save it here. No, hold on. Save.
Bon. Oh. 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 Early man at arms and long moment. Huh. Oh, yeah, here we go. Research those upgrades quick. Archers, delay them. Oh, here we go. Oh, they are going to be closing on this side. No, 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 I'm not going to take a risk. I can't take a risk. Just keep recruiting, keep recruiting. Every upgrade I'm getting my hands on right now. This is madness. I'm forgetting herbalisters as well. Wrong assault is scaring the life out of me. My teeth are shattering. I'm really shaking in my boots right now. My heartbeat is shooting up. I can feel that adrenaline punching through me. Okay. I'm gonna swamp us. Be prepared. Oh damn! Is this really going to be enough? I don't know what to say. Okay, they're delaying them. Charge! Right out, right out, right out! Bypass them, bypass them! Bypass them, charge them! I'm sending in troops. Hold the ground, Arbalisters! Show them what you need of! Beyond this, God help us! Oh my god, those delays are so damn precious! Oh yeah! There we go, Arvalatrier power. That is the strength of Arvalatriers. That, my friend, is why you recruit Arvalatriers. They just mince through them like they are made of butter. Kill those bowmen. Kill those fragile bowmen. Alright, alright. Oh, oh really? Okay. Alright, wait. This is a close one, people. It's far too close to call it. Burn the town. You know what? These archers can will take forever to destroy the town. Okay? It is only the soldiers we need to fear. I forgot that. Welcome to the Arbalisters. The Arbalisters greet you. Yeah, we just got melted off. Quick, quick, quick. How is this handling? Yeah. Dude, come on. You're wasting your time. We have done this. More than one hour. After a brutal slog, no less. And I'm still getting cavalry out. And I'm still getting cavalry men out. Oh, 
skip them. There we go. No need to worry, we can hold them off. That's it, that's it, that's how we hold them off. This group of spearmen or archers are pathetic. Okay, now that we have tent handily with you people, how about we give you a welcome party? There we go. Watch your backs because we have friends coming in. Watch your backs. You can burn the town for all I care. There you go. We, 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 we have practically won at this point. There we go. Okay. Bumbling fools. What bumbling fools? All right. Attack! Oi, oi, oi! Where are you running off, to, dear? Where are you running off, to, dear? Rush behind the marble esters. Oh, in pain. There we go. Oh yeah, there we go. Stand and fight, cards. Where do you think you're running off? Oh, in pain. Charge them. Poor souls. Miserable souls. Oh. 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 Shoot this dude. That's it. That's it. Come on. Oh. Shoot them. Wally. 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 Impale them. And we win! That was pure torture. Oh my god, after five long attempts. After a hard won battle against a scattered enemy, the French succeeded in halting the English chevauchee at Pont Valin. The English army was not invincible. The French cause was not yet lost. Oh. Bow to Arbal Letriers. Bow to the Diva Supreme Arbal Letriers. <laughs> I won. After so much pain and misery. What's this? I, 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 With rebels and raiders eliminated my, at Koshra. King Charles V faced one last threat to France. My hair are standing on edge and I got goosebumps. Alright. That was hell. The Battle of Pomala. The myth of English invincibility had been dispelled. The French army had undermined England's grip on France for the first time. Okay, we were not content. You all. Match completion. Okay. Arrow making. Video. Longbows were powerful weapons, but keeping archers supplied with ammunition was a major undertaking. This is a modern arrow. Small and lightweight. Pretty much what everyone shoots these days. Compared to this medieval war arrow. Look at the size of this thing. It's a beast. A medieval army might need more than a million war arrows on campaign, and each one had to be made by hand. It was a labor-intensive business, and the person who did it was called a fletcher. First, a log is split into square staves. 
Then the Fletcher uses a plane to start roughing out the shape. Ugh, how do I get it round? Not only have you got to make it round, you've got to make it bobtailed. Look bob at that. Tailed. You see that's coming down thinner down that end. There's a natural taper coming down there to that end. A plane with a curved blade is used to create the taper. This makes the arrow aerodynamic. This is an incredibly painstaking process for one arrow. Most of them are just for one shot as well. Next, a slot is cut to receive a piece of horn. The horn reinforces the knock. That's the notch that fits the arrow to the bowstring. Without the horn insert, the power of a heavy war bow could split and shatter an arrow. Once the horn is in place, the knock is sawn and shaped. Then the Fletcher has to attach the feathers to the shaft. Now what you've got to do is you've got to get rid of the stiffness of the quill. You're going to work it down so it's nice and thin. So this is dogfish skin? Yeah, medieval sandpaper. The feathers are glued in place and then secured with thread. The final process is to arm the arrow with its arrowhead. The person who makes these is called an arrowsmith. From a blank piece of iron, he starts with the part that fits over the arrow shaft. First he makes the bar flat, then uses a special former to create a socket. The final stage is to hammer out the shape of the head. Arrow stocks had to be prepared far in advance of a campaign. It was impossible to make them in sufficient numbers overnight. A medieval war arrow like this could only be shot from a big, exceptionally powerful bow. And it packed a mighty punch. Ooh. All right. So the reason the person is called a Fletcher is because the feathers which are attached to the end of the arrow are called fletchings which will make the arrow go straight and you know not wobble down. Okay. That is why they are called Fletchers. And yes, it is a very painful and a lengthy process. Okay. Just calculate 3000 long women. One long woman can shoot six arrows a minute. So, 3,000 long bowmen can empty 18,000 arrows in a minute. And each long bowman was supplied with 60 to 72 arrows. So, do the calculation. 72 times 3 is 216, 216 times. So, you are using up 216,000 arrows for just that one battle. Utter madness. Okay. Oh, yeah. It is a very painful process to make those arrows. And you need, that's why they were called Fletchers. Fletchers are the people who make the arrow. Uh, Arrowsmiths, you had different kinds of arrowheads. You had um, barbed points for piercing into horses' flanks. You had broadheads. You, had also, you also had um, special arrowheads for penetrating plate armor. Uh, that I think that one is called, that point is called a bodkin point. Okay. All right. Page from history. Veteran de Wis. Clean, I guess. Okay. Bertrand de Gusclin. Gusclin. I don't know how to pronounce that. Sorry about that. The hero of Kosher and Pomala, Bertrand de Gusclin, was one of the greatest knights in France, but he won his victories by abandoning the dogma of chivalric warfare. De Gusclin, de Gusclin preferred not to be drawn into pitched battles and focused instead on cutting off supply routes and setting ambushes. The English fo forces who suffered under his raiding called him the Black Dog of Brochliand, I guess. His pragmatism was vividly on display when he personally put an end to a dynastic duel between Pedro and, and Enrique of Castile. Stepping into the Battle of Brothers, he held Pedro down so Enrique could kill the uh, could deliver the killing blow. This less than chivalrous act secured Castile as an ally and earned de Guilin the rank of Constable of France. The so constable is a commander in chief of the armies of France. And this tactic is called Fabian tactic. The setting ambushes, cutting off supply routes, advocated by Fabius. I don't remember his full name, but when Hannibal was attacking Rome in the Second Punic Wars and when 
the Roman army had, had been crushed at Cannae. This is what uh, it was cowardly, uh, but this is effective. Okay, so if you cannot directly pin down an army, if you don't want to be drawn into a pitch battle, you disrupt their supplies, raid them, set ambushes, you whittle them down steadily, slowly and steadily. It may be cowardly and it may not be effective. What happened was. Uh, many senators disagreed with Fabius with his Fabian tactics, and that is why they mustered a huge army and sent it off to Cannae. That huge army, unfortunately, was completely butchered at the Battle of Cannae by Hannibal, who used their aggressive push in the brilliant double envelopment maneuver and destroyed them. So they understood after that when you when you lost seventy thousand men. Okay, this guy makes sense. Let's use that. And most of the times, this is a very effective tactic. You can slow enemy armies down. You can weaken their supplies, destroy their supplies. You reduce their capacity to make war while you build up your strength. Very, very effective. Okay. Well, let's go back to the main menu. All right, guys. That's all for this video. It was a torturous video, man. You know what? Uh, if somebody does it better than me, please give me your own divine guidance. This was hell. Anyways, if you liked the video, then leave a like. If you did not like the video, then leave a dislike. Share, comment, and subscribe. And make sure you hit that notification bell so that you don't miss out on any new videos when they are released. Until the next video, this is Shinobi Ranger signing out. Bye.